So I am about to do a walkthrough at this corporate client company that wants to hire me to do a mural in their kitchen area. This is my first time meeting anyone from this company. We've been emailing back and forth for a little bit. We'll see how this goes. Looks like I got the gig, so it's gonna be rad. Let's check it out. So I'm at the Indeed offices here in downtown Seattle. Got a blank wall behind me. Got to paint a mural here in the kitchen area where the employees are gonna hang out and relax, so that's pretty cool. I got three days to do this in, so I'm gonna do the background layer, let that dry, and then probably do the actual art part over the next two days. So I'm gonna get started, check it out. Background is done, pretty simple background. Now I gotta sketch the character on there. There's this island here right in front, so this isn't gonna be one where I use a projector. It's kind of too small and simple to really worry about a grid, so I'm just gonna freehand this one and see how that works out. So get out my trusty sidewalk chalk and sketch my character on the wall. Pretty, pretty, pretty chill. Day two, sketched things out yesterday, got the, the character up there for the most part, and now I'm gonna actually be painting today. This one's a bit more of a simplified version of one of my murals. I'm doing more of like a flat color fill with some graphic line work on this one. When the client came to me, they had like their budget in place and this is what they were willing to spend and it was like a little bit different from what I was hoping to get for a fully rendered mural. So instead of being like, no, I don't want to do it, we kind of talked it out and figured out that if I did a bit more of a simplified style, it would still look great. So that's what I'm doing. Today's just about kind of filling in colors and hopefully by the end of today, that step will be done and then tomorrow do some line work. Maybe even some line work today. We'll see how things go. This is a very chill working environment. It's a wall that I don't even need a ladder for and uh, yeah, there's like a nice little kitchen island where I can set my stuff. Super cool. I'm looking at the tops of buildings here out of these uh, downtown Seattle windows. It's a pretty inspiring place to work. So. Thank you to Indeed for supporting artists and for making their business cooler by having uh, painted mural artwork right here in their offices. So I'm gonna get to work, figure out these colors, and we'll see how this goes. Can we watch? Yeah, how are you guys doing? All right. What is, uh, <laughs> is a guy seating, a woman seating? Yeah. With a helmet? Yeah. It's like a penguin, penguin. costume. <laughs> oh, okay. Crazy explorer, maybe. This is the concept. Right? Oh, kind of spin it over one. Yeah, they have their little mascot is like a penguin. Oh. So um, this is like uh, my style, maybe of uh, their mascots. Yeah, but more strange. <laughs> you started it yesterday, so uh, yeah. You do, you do this all the time? Yeah, I have a lot of murals around Seattle and New York and LA, Brazil. Oh, you do that? And yeah. Everything? Yeah, all over the place. And then I have a shop in Seattle in Pioneer Square. Oh, you do? Yeah. So just trying to do art all the time. You yeah. Know? Cool. Yeah. Something you love, so it's yeah. making money out of it. <laughs> right? It's, uh, it's my passion. Yeah. The power went out on this floor maybe an hour ago, but there's a big old window in here providing some natural light, so I'm gonna keep on painting. This dark blue really took it there. I think it looks starting to look cool. Ha <laughs> ha. Yeah, yeah. This 
the end of the day, I finished pretty much all the color fill-ins, the flat color fill-ins. Tomorrow I will probably wash away my chalk lines if there is any and then do the black line work to give it the actual details and make it a finished product. It's looking pretty cool. I love that sort of deep, deep blue of the penguin costume. I think that's my favorite color in that whole thing. Really sets it off. Yeah, so tomorrow, line work, details, the fun part. Uh, let's do that. See you tomorrow. Peace. I'm going home. Wow. So, you know what today is, Chelsea? What? It's the last day of the mural. Oh, I thought it was like <laughs> National Donut Day or something. It's National Last Day of the Mural Day. Woohoo! Going to downtown Seattle, gonna get my black pens and just do line work all day. I'm hoping I have like two to three more hours left. This has been a very chill mural, super simple. I'm really excited. So that's what's going on now. Yes. You want a coffee? Yes, please. No, put your phone down when you're driving. Oh. Yeah, safe. All right, it's the last day. I'm about to do the line art. I'm gonna be using these Faber Castell India ink markers to do my black lines. It's kind of taking me back to my old days. I used to do almost all my murals with just like solid color fills and graphic black lines. So it's kind of fun to do them like this. Just wiped off all the sidewalk chalk and now it's time to do the final details. So it's the exciting fun part. <laughs> Done. Thank you so much to Indeed for having me to let me put my art in these awesome office spaces that are still under construction, but they're gonna be really cool when it's all finished up in here. It's pretty cool to continue to put my art in these sort of environments, these office environments with these big companies. It's like such a huge compliment that they would reach out to me and ask me to make something to make their offices just a little bit cooler. This was a super chill, fun one, and it's just really bold and graphic and cartoony, and um, I hope they like it. I like it, I think it's pretty cool. Little penguin warrior explorer lady who has her little pet tree that's growing. <laughs> pretty fun. Thanks so much for watching. Thanks so much to my patrons who support me on Patreon. Their names are gonna be kind of appearing on the screen right after this. If you guys want to support me on Patreon, the link is down in the description. It helps me keep this channel going, and I would super appreciate it. Uh, yeah, I will catch you guys on the next one. I'm going to clean up my stuff and get out of here and go back to my shop statics, uh, which is just like a half mile from here. So I'll enjoy this nice sunny day, and yeah, catch you guys next time.